Hey guys, uh, welcome back. So uh, in this video, we will uh, talk about the difference among G20, G8 and uh, G7. I hope so many times you heard about uh, these particular groups. Okay, so uh, group 20, group of 20, uh, group of 8 and group of 7. So now we have two only. One is uh, group 20 and another one is uh, group 7. So group 20, it was founded in 1999 and uh, group 7, G7, it was found, founded in 1975. So now what is the difference uh, among these uh, different different groups? So first one, there is a only difference of member countries. They have a similar goal. Okay. So previously, like we have, if you talk about the G20, so these are the 20 members, which are generally part of uh, uh, group 20. So this year, uh, the presidency that generally belongs to India. Okay. And these are the members. So there is a difference of members only. Okay. So group 20, we have 20 countries. So all these are generally part of group 20. Uh, previously, this uh, G7 is generally known as uh, uh, G8. So, uh, Russia was earlier part of uh, uh, this this G7 group for, was earlier known as uh, G8 because Russia was part of this one. After Russia-Ukraine war the first time, okay, around 1966-67. Uh, so, uh, Russia was uh, like uh, uh, this uh, group, they generally... Uh, abandoned uh, Russia from uh, their member nations okay so now after Russia exit from the uh, G8 it become G7 so if you talk about the G7 so these are the member nations who generally belongs to uh, group 7 so there is a only difference of member nations in G8 G20 we have 20 uh, nations which are generally part of this particular uh, organization and in uh, G7, we have seven groups. So earlier, this G7 was known as G8, uh, but after the exit of Russia, it is generally known as G7. Okay, so they have a similar goal, like uh, they generally share their resources. Like this is uh, being a common group, like we have SARC, ASEAN, BRICS and all. So whenever we form a group, we generally share our resources or um, developed nations they generally help uh, uh, like they generally do monetary as well as technical assistance they generally provide these kind of assistance to the underdeveloped or developing nations okay so again g20 and g7 they have a similar goal the only difference is they have different different members okay in g20 uh, like we have 20 members and india this year basically india is hosting this particular events or uh, the meeting of g20 and we have uh, this presidency for G20 2023-24 okay and uh, G there is no existence of G8 now uh, previously like now G8 is generally known as G7 after the exit of uh, G7 uh, after the exit of uh, Russia okay so I hope you found this uh, video or uh, this information useful if you like please uh, do share with your friends and uh, do subscribe my channel thank you